G'day, my name's John Barry. Welcome to another video tutorial about Adobe Premiere Pro. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you in less than one minute that the color scheme has been changed to Windows 7 Basic. Thank you, Camtasia. The hint and tip that I'm actually going to show you is how to use offset trimming with linked clips. Most people that I talk to end up doing something like this. Thank you, Autosave. Selecting the clip, right clicking on the clip and unlinking it. Now when you do that, you have no sense of whether or not you've just lost sync. This is no good. This is what you want to do. Undo, undo. I can see these are joined together. Now in order to see whether or not you've got audio and video linked to something, you get an underline of the name of the clip. So if I was to re-undo that, so what I've done here is gone back to it being unlinked and notice the underline is no longer part of the naming. I'll just undo again. Now they're linked together and the line is there. Now to override the link, I'm going to hold the Alt key and then I'm just going to select it and move the actual trim point. The clip is still married. If I hold Alt and I grab the clip, let go of Alt and move it, it tells me how many frames out of sync I've just moved this. Then I can right click inside here and move this clip into sync or slip it into sync. So I'm going to move the video back into sync, which means that the audio will stay where it is. And that's basically how you go about doing this. Now if I hold the control key and I start selecting points like this, notice it's grabbed both. Again, holding control and alt to undo the link, it means that now I'm actually grabbing these links in their own order. And I can do changes like so. Thanks for joining me. My name is John Barry. Ciao for now.